We're going to check in with what happened elsewhere in the Premier Division this evening. There were only two other games, uh, remember. First of all, we're heading uh, west. Uh, only one point separated Connacht neighbours like Rovers in seventh and Galway United in sixth before tonight's match uh, at the showgrounds, the first Connacht derby in the league since 2017. And Galway worked the first major chance of the night, a long kick out, not properly dealt with by uh, Sligo and Ed McCarthy, a scorer last Friday, had his effort uh, well saved by Ed McGinty. Uh, in the Sligo goal. Sligo then had a great chance to uh, take the lead after uh, Simon Power's shot was uh, saved when Ellis Chapman fired the rebound high over the bar and alas, neither side could find a goal in a tight second half, so nil-nil final score at the showgrounds as well. There were goals in Derry though, only one point the difference between Derry and Pats in fourth and fifth ahead of tonight's match at the Ryan McBride uh, Brandywell and it was Rory Higgins Derry that made the brighter start so after weathering some early pressure uh, Ben Doherty's cross was was finished off by Danny Mullen. Just seven minutes into the second half then, Pat Hoobin, obligatory goal for him. He made it 2-0 to Derry from close range. Rapid response though from Pats. Uh, Connor Keeley grabbed the goal back uh, two minutes later. And uh, the quickfire football continued indeed. The, the set piece stuff uh, continued. Three goals in four minutes in this one as Derry made it 3-1 through Cameron McJanet. So 3-1 the final score at the Ryan McBride brand new well there. Big, big result that for Derry, wasn't it?